Welcome to your Monday edition of Celebville's Ups and Downs with myself, Phenomenaga the Flame, serving you nothing but entertainment news, realness, honey. So gather around, boys and girls, let's get into it. The latest celebrity towel about to hit the bookshelves is setting the Twitter streets alight as it promises to tantalize readers with sordid details pertaining to award winning playwright Mongeni Ngema through the lens of his estranged ex wife, Koliswa Ndune Ngema. Now, in the memoir titled Heart of a Strong Woman, Koliswa shares harrowing details of the abuse she allegedly suffered at the hands of Mongeni. But the part that really got people talking is when Olisa shared gruesome details about violently attacking Lele Di Kumalo after discovering that she was having an affair with her then husband Mongeni Ngema. Yo, somebody needs to get me a copy ASAP because I can't wait to get my hands on some of that tea, honey. In the latest celebs doing anything to secure the bad news, Lil Kim is apparently in talks with the execs over at OnlyFans about joining the social media platform with on-again, off-again boyfriend Mr. Papers. Now, for some of you who aren't familiar with OnlyFans, it's a digital platform where content creators pretty much get coins from their followers who pay a monthly fee to view their content. Now, the content I'm referring to in this instance contains pictures and videos with a more adult theme, if you know what I mean. Now, Cardi B is also on there, but she's taking a tamer approach and asking her fans what they'd like to see on her page. I'm guessing they're probably going to want to see adult stuff too. I mean, what sells better than sex? So Miley Cyrus managed to raise a few eyebrows recently during a podcast interview when she shared a few shocking facts about her childhood crushes and her sex life with her ex-husband Liam Hemsworth. Now, in what we call a no-holds-barred tell-all, Miley shared intimate details about her first sexual experience involving girls when she was just a teen and about how she lied about being a virgin to her ex-husband Liam for 10 years because she didn't want to seem like a loser. Now as if that's not weird enough, she also spoke about how when she was growing up, she used to find Minnie Mouse hot. Okay, I, I guess... Wow, I, I wonder why people are like this. <laughs> Next. We recently told you guys about the shocking revelation made by Lauren Hill's daughter, Sela Mali, who spoke about the years of abuse she suffered at the hands of her mother growing up. Well, Lauren Hill took to Facebook to state her case and pretty much said that the only thing she's guilty of was disciplining in anger. I mean, I can't say I'm surprised. Black moms and apologies, usually not in the same WhatsApp group. Also, disciplining in anger, isn't that the textbook definition of fighting? Anyway, I'm a sip my tea, child. In the latest celeb baby bump news, congratulations are in order for John Legend and wife Chrissy Teigen. The couple got the shock of their lives when they discovered that they are expecting their third child just shortly after Chrissy went under the knife to remove her breast implants. Now, Chrissy took a routine pregnancy test before the procedure, so it was all systems go when the test came back negative. One can only imagine their terror when they realized that indeed she went under the knife with a baby in her belly. Now, the couple also spoke out about how how they used to make jokes about people having corona babies and now they too are having one. Ah, oh, guys, don't we just love it? And here's what you can expect right here on BET. You have no idea what she keeps hidden. Behind her smile, she bears secret scars. Behind her smile is a story. Will you listen? Join us by celebrating powerful female stories every Sunday this Women's Month, only on BT Africa Channel 129. Well, it's time for me to head on out of here, but let's do this again on Wednesday at 9.30 p.m. CAT, right here on BT Africa Channel 129. For now, let's keep in contact on social media. Do tag at BT underscore Africa and use the hashtag BT Breaks F to let me know what you thought about tonight's show. For now, from myself and Amananga the Flame, as always, stay safe, stay sanitized, stay with me. Mwah. Bye, honey.